Okay, we're back. Huh. <laughs> uh, yeah. What can I say? So last time we unintuitively ruined a theater show and a meeting with his celebrity has gone very wrong. And by that, I meant he tried to kill me. But a bigger matter at hand, it seems like the major world governments are falling under Zarax's control. We don't know why. And that's what we're gonna figure out today. Let's get to it. Where do we leave off? Bad news, Agent. The South Atlantic Union's also joining Zaraxis. Oh yeah, that. What's going on? Don't know. We need to find out how Juniper's involved in all of this. Well, tune in and hear for yourself. Okay, let's see. This is Operation Eavesdrop. Things to do for JJ, stage manager, bring gas masks, update the security system, increase gas flow to arm light. This is the fabricator. Let, okay, radio. This just in. In a surprising reversal of a strong isolationist stance, the president of the South Atlantic Union has just announced a formal partnership with Soraxis Defense. So Raxis has earned my trust. The South Atlantic Union will support Soraxis defense in all of its upcoming initiatives. Blanche! Okay, shut up. Let's do this. Let's see. So Juniper's been working with the Fabricator. As you saw at the theater, she builds, well, call them luxury death traps for Zoraxis. Uh, uh -huh. I wonder what she's been doing with Juniper. Agency Intel says she operates out of a high-security workshop in Barcelona. We've left it alone because, frankly, she's very good at her job. Well, there's nothing for it. Let's find out what Juniper's up to. So, this is my handler. We go down the roof. And this is me. <sighs> well, if this means being stealthy, then I probably hate it. Oh, boy. Two days ago. Okay. This is the place. So, if you can disarm the security system, we can sneak in and figure out what Juniper is doing for Zaraxis. See if you can get down there without tripping any alarms. Hmm. If I were you, I'd start by turning off those lasers. Hmm. Agent, I'm tossing down a flashlight. Flashlight. Oh. All right. Excellent work. She might have something in her desk. Can you get it open? Figures. Hmm. Huh. Interesting. Uh, come on, my flashlight turned off. has been making these masks and <gasps> Juniper's been using them to impersonate heads of state. Hmm, but why? Perhaps the desk has more details on their plan. Hmm. All right. Thank you. 
He's impersonating heads of state to get to their nuclear codes. This is bad, Agent. We Seems need so. to get this briefcase. All right. Wow. Oh, that looks like the mimic mask they're talking about. Agent, take this tracking device. Can you hide it away in that mask somewhere? Good thinking, Agent. They won't be able to find the tracking device in there. Make sure to put the mask back together when you're done. Excellent work, Agent. Now, all we need to do is... I think I heard something. I gotta go check it out. Quick, hide! Or, uh... Or, I, uh, I don't know, find a disguise or something. Mask task number 12. Uh, something, something with the rack with the head. What was I that see line? movement. <clears throat> Who's down there? Ma'am? The South Atlantic you? Union will support Could you identify yourself, please? In all of its upcoming initiatives. <laughs> yes. Yes, it will. Oh, uh, sorry to disturb you. I'll leave you to your, to your... Ooh, well, that was too close for comfort. Put the mask back where you found it, will you? Good. Now get out of there before the fabricator comes back. Man, this is messy. Barricading a lie. Nice. From the mimic mask and everything else we saw in the fabricator's workshop, it looks like Juniper's been impersonating heads of state to siphon their nuclear codes to Zarax's defense. At this rate, he could have the world at his feet by the end of the week. We hmm. need to stop Juniper, and fast. All of this is happening within a week. Well... I might have an unhealthy alcohol addiction. Addiction. <clears throat> hmm. Barcelona, Spain. Now they've gotten to the Pacific League. Well, that only leaves one major power left free of Zor's influence. We need to move, Agent. Hmm. Well, I would like to continue now, but unfortunately, that's... I'm going to cut it short here. So, uh, yeah. See you next time.